did what I belong to, you know, they dictate me a role that I had to follow and I had to pursue in Mexico, you know, that is the way that we are there. So all my life, I had inside that I want to be a filmmaker. I was shooting everything, music videos, everything, everything, you know, but that was my hobby. So at the time that in the real business field, I was dying, you know, because I say, I want to be a filmmaker all my life and I have to change this. So when I was like 26, I applied to USC film school to study my master degree in directing for five years. So I was very lucky. I was accepted. I went to the to LA. Uh, I went to the interviews and and they, uh, I was very lucky, you know, to be accepted at USC. I couldn't believe that I was going to belong to that kind of mafia, you know, that is a mafia there. 14,000 people and I was one of the 40s there. So it was like a dream come true, something that they say, I have been waiting all my life for this and I'm in the right path. So since then, I have been very, very focused in my career and I graduated in 2002. I went there for five years, and uh, before graduating, I got the Directors Guild of America Student Awards uh, from the DGA in LA, and that opened the doors for me. I wrote uh, Sea of Dreams, and when I was in film school, and two weeks later, I got the money, you know, to, to make this, this international film in English, and it's a lovely film. I want to bring back the romanticism to cinema. I am exhausted and tired of human misery, and I